Isan, we hardly knew you. The comet scientists hoped would light up the sky with its brilliant tail may have passed just a little too close to the sun. Astrophysicist Carl Battams. We've never seen this before, and um, we have no idea when we're going to see something as amazing as this again. Um, at this point, I do suspect that the comet has broken up and has died, but um, ISON has surprised us a lot over the past few months, so let's at least give it a, uh, a couple more hours before we start writing the obituary. The comet, which was moving faster than 217 miles per second as it approached the sun, is believed to have been vaporized. What isn't clear at this point is whether the heat destroyed the entire comet. The one thing scientists do know about ISON is that it is no ordinary comet. ISON is just weird. It has behaved unpredictably at times with and when it's done something strange, we've spent some time sort of scratching our heads, figuring out, okay, what's it, um, what's it doing? And then when we think we know what it's doing, and we think we can predict what it's then going to do, it goes and does something different. If, in fact, any of ISON did survive the close encounter, it should be visible to the naked eye in the next week or so.